Action News, live at 4. Developing now, live at 4, we are learning more about a police sergeant who was injured in a shootout in southeast Fresno on Saturday evening. Officers were in the area of Platt and 8th as they responded to a shot spotter activation. While investigating, the gunman pulled up to a patrol car and opened fire, wounding a sergeant. Good afternoon, I'm Graciela Moreno. And I'm Dale Yarong. We're live on ABC 30, Hulu Live, and wherever you stream. We have live team coverage of this developing story. Action News reporter Brianna Willis is looking into the homicide that first brought officers into the neighborhood. But we begin with Tiffany Olin, live outside Community Regional Medical Center, where the sergeant is now recovering. Tiffany. Well, Dell, interim police chief Minnie Castro called Saturday's shooting an ambush. She's grateful the sergeant will be okay, but says Saturday was one of the worst days for her and her officers. A Fresno police sergeant is recovering in the hospital after being shot multiple times Saturday evening. Officers were investigating a shot spotter activation near Platt and 8th in southeast Fresno when the gunman, 40-year-old Andy Morales, returned to the scene and shot the sergeant as he was working in his patrol car. The bullets went through the door and hit the sergeant's legs. It was basically door to door as he pulled up to the patrol car and opened fire. The suspect continued driving on. The sergeant, being struck with gunfire, had the presence of mind to activate his body camera at that moment and initiate a really short pursuit. Morales then got out of his car and continued to shoot at the sergeant. Numerous gunshots were fired, um, both from the suspect, from sergeant, the sergeant involved, and about 49 seconds elapsed before another officer was able to arrive. Two officers arrived and fired at Morales. <laughs> At least a dozen gunshots can be heard whizzing through the air in a video obtained by Action News. Uh, is down. Copy, that's back down. Neighbors say it was a terrifying night. We didn't know what direction these bullets were flying from. We didn't know, we didn't know if it was directly in front of us, to the right, to the left. So, I mean, it was just panic, like get down to the floor, like do not get hit, like get down to the floor and crawl out of that room. Police say Morales was struck about seven times and died at the hospital. The sergeant is expected to be okay. I truly believe knowing the sergeant and knowing what, what he has said to me, it was to keep this community safe as well because the suspect that would attack a police officer isn't going to stop with a police officer. The sergeant is a 21-year veteran of the force who Mayor Jerry Dyer says showed true heroism. And, uh, he put his, um, his life in incredible danger when he responded to this incident. Uh, he was relentless and not allowing this individual to escape. And he acted with extreme valor and extreme courage. Police say Morales was a danger to the public as a gang member who was arrested multiple times for weapons violations, domestic violence related charges, and driving under the influence. And the chief said the suspect did have drugs near him, so they do believe it's possible he was under the influence, but at this time, that is not known. Meanwhile, the sergeant is here recovering and eager to get back to work for the community. Live in downtown Fresno, Tiffany Olin, ABC 30 Action News. Hey, Central California, stay up to date with all the most important news and weather. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to ABC 30 Action News.